So it's so hard to evaluate the quarterback position in a vacuum. And if essentially the trade for Matthew Stafford was a bet on that, right? It's a bet on like, if you take this guy and you swap context and you put them, him in the golf situation, which is undeniably wonderful for quarterback, you're going to see him jump from that 10 to 15 range to maybe that five to 10 range perhaps. But I would also argue that it's not just about, okay, who is better, but it is about the difference in skill set and the difference in strength and weaknesses. 